Have you ever wondered why we use terms like DRO and DR0 interchangeably? I've wondered it often, and I've never come up with a good answer for you other than it's just a bunch of crocker hooey crap. Why? Because DR0 doesn't make any sense. Sure, it does. I get it. You're all arguing with me already. You get it. DRO is what we're talking about. DR0. Whatever. All right? Differential reinforcement of other behavior or zero rates of responding, whichever way you want to look at it. But zero responding can't possibly happen unless the organism's dead. They have to do something. They have to respond in some way, shape, or form. Even if breathing is what it is, they're still responding for crying out loud. So anyway, so if we're trying to reduce behavior, we could use a DRO procedure, differential reinforcement of other behavior. If you're trying to get me to do something other than talking, then you might want to reinforce me when either number one, I'm remaining silent. Notice how that's an action, remaining silent. Um, or, I don't know, clapping my hands like a seal. I don't know. Whatever it is that you're trying to get me, reinforce something other than talking, okay? Um, and then that's going to get you on your DROs. Um, and that's, that, that I, I don't know. I, I ain't got nothing else for you. So maybe you should reinforce me by clicking the button down below that says subscribe.